Well, up in the ring, the bell has not yet sounded, but as instructions were being given, there was a little bit of push and a little bit of shove, and now the spoiler has come out to wrap the jacket he was wearing around the neck of his opponent, Ox Baker. But let's tell you that the spoiler with his 270 some pounds is the man in the mask, and he's the man with his back up against the corner in this match that takes place here where there are two rings. The one you're looking at is ring number two, the one closest to the camera. And Big Ox Baker, it's redundant to call him big, it, almost redundant to call him an ox because it's apparent, but he is a tough customer and this match has a time limit of one fall or 15 minutes, whichever comes first. There's the ox properly tagged and the referee is Bronco Lubitsch as Ox moves in. Now notice what he's doing with those powerful forearms of his. He's reaching around and trying to grab the shoulders of the spoiler and to use his wrists in crisscross fashion underneath the chin and against the throat. And spoiler is trying to maneuver his head to um, nullify it. The Ox moving in to stay on to the spoiler. Here are two solid and tough customers, rugged individuals. And that foot in the stomach will accentuate what he's trying to do here. And one is to bring Spoiler down to size. Now, Spoiler's the kind of a guy who stands tall in that ring. A lot of tall men bend over. Spoiler's not that type. And these are big fellows laying in the big part of the arm, the fist and the forearm and the wrist to gain their, uh, their effort. Bear hug for Ox Baker as he puts the squeeze on, on the spoiler. And you can hear Ox Baker as he sounds off to tell the referee to stay out of his life. The bear hug. And A handful of whiskers for the spoiler, and he's trying to get, set him up there so he can grab with that left hand and then come around with, a, with his right. No, he's, he's, got a, he's got a double whisker to grab. The whiskers go come to a point on both sides of the chin. I don't know what they call that kind of a beard, but um, whatever it is, it's the one Ox Baker's got. So, spoiler captures Ox Baker by the head, by the throat, and muscles him down to the, to the canvas. Using the pressure, working that fist and the knuckles around into the bald-headed area of Ox Baker. The spoiler, of course, was working bone against bone, which is the way to get to well, you get somebody's attention when you do it, I want to tell you. Spoiler drew up that time and did not come rushing the way uh, Baker wanted them to. These are big men dealing out big doses of punishment because a 300 pounder and a 270 pounder, when they land, whether it's with fists or feet, they land and land hard.
And he just came in there using that left hand of his in the uh, area of the heart. I don't know whether this blow that he delivered that time was his heart punch. It didn't seem to me like he had him set up properly for it. But here he goes for the mask of the spoiler and he's got part of it. When you get that knot open, the rest of it is a matter of working on the laces. Five minutes have gone by. Ten minutes remain in this match. And Baker starts to crowd the spoiler. And he decides he's going to give the spoiler something to worry about by working that mask over. And he's got him now with the spoiler claw, the brain claw. He puts the big right hand onto the head of the spoiler. And here, not having hair can be either a help or a detriment. It should make it just a little bit uh, slippery for Spoiler, but Spoiler has a glove on that hand. This, of course, adds to his chances of applying that, that particular hold. They're in the ropes, and that's why the referee is trying to force the uh, claw hold so that it doesn't do any more damage than it has already done. That's a hole that can be particularly dangerous and particularly punishing. And he's got it back again. Spoiler. Putting the big squeeze on the big head of Big Ox. There you look at the hold. The, the Ox just swung around with that left hand of his and knock the spoiler clear, but the spoiler is only worried about the fact that the blow slipped off. And of course, Ox may, like a lot of fellows who have no hair, may have uh, rubbed his head with some, some substance. He can always claim that he puts it on there to grow hair. And this makes it almost impossible for a spoiler to put 100% pressure on that um, hold. Spoiler, he's got the hold, but he is also caught in a bear hug, and the twist and the pressure is mounting. Now, Ox's fans are screaming for him to get up. The spoiler, who has a lot of fans who have a deep respect for his ability, are sounding off to the spoiler to come in there and finish off the ox. He put a stop to it that time. Look at the size of those hands and you have some idea of why ox is able to stop it with hand pressure instead of uh, having to put his forearm up under there. He didn't get to stop it. And that big boot of his did not damage the right hand of Spoiler. But now Spoiler decides that if he can't hold it on the bald head, perhaps he can hold it on that hairy stomach of uh, Ox Baker. He reaches in there and takes a good portion of it in his, in his grip, but he is about to lose his mask again, and this can divert him, and it can also make him... It can also make him fight to keep it on. And now it's gotten to the point where Spoiler is not going to be able to disregard the fact that the laces on his mask have become loosened and some of them have lost their, have, 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 have lost their holes uh, altogether. And he's gonna have to watch that. Well, he's not only bringing the ox to the chair, but the chair to the ox. and we, and Ox just pointed out that he doesn't care whether they hit him on the head or not. And Spoiler now is on the spot as Ox Baker starts to 
warm up to his task of knocking the big man down. If he can damage that right hand enough, he is going to be able to take away Spoiler's best weapon. There are five, less than five minutes remaining in this battle of giants. And as Ox picked up that hand and tried to do something with it, he found something he could do with it, and that was to chop his teeth down there and to work on that uh, thumb and see what he could do about it. Spoiler is trying to tie up a little bit of uh, tightness in those laces. Here is, he's ready now with that mask just tightened up a little bit. Front headlock. Front headlock is the effort of the ox and Spoiler now has had a multi-pronged attack from Ox Baker, fists and feet, and he has also, here's a drive into the back of the neck. He doesn't know which one to protect, his own head, his mask, or his effort with the, um, to protect his hand, that's, that's the one that worries him the most. And here he comes into the second ring. They just crawl from one ring to another, and we've got action going on on both sides. There are three minutes remaining in this match. So, Ox Baker as he bores into the spoiler. Comes back now into the ring number two where the match is uh, legally, uh, legally started. And of course, with two rings up here, there's an awful temptation to throw a man from one to another or to work on, work on something. Baker just tried to drive in that hard punch that time and the spoiler blocked him. And here we have the spoiler coming around to clamp on the, the claw, but the big foot broke it loose. We want to remind you that wrestling will again be here in the Sam Houston Coliseum next Friday night with the Texas State title at stake in the final event when Dusty Rhodes tries to make it a clean sweep against the... Um, efforts of um, maniac Mark Lewin. Mark Lewin has the Texas title, but we are, uh, Mark Lewin's Texas title, uh, uh, Mark Lewin's Brass Knucks title was taken away from him by Dusty, and fans look for it to happen in this one too. The U.S. American tag team title at stake, Jose Lothario and Tiger Conway defending against Hito and Sakuruda, the Japanese team, it ought to be great. Our ticket office at 1919, uh, at the corner of uh, Caroline, at the corner of Pease, will be open 8.30 to 4.30 each day of the week. Each day of the week. And we tell you that Love TV and Stereo are ready for you now. And we say good night to you, ladies and gentlemen. There's less than a minute to go now as the spoiler comes in to grab hold of the head of Ox Baker in the try to squeeze this out, and there is still time for him to win this one, and he, and he knows it. But there is that left fist of his, and here is Baker as he tries to drop his 300 pounds. Less than 30 seconds to go. Uh, and the, the pair of giants now trying their, their best, but it's, it's uh, Baker who now has, well, he stopped to tell the fans he was going to use his heart punch, and he's not going to have time to, to do anything. 
There is the, he has to get that clear spot. And there is the bell and the 15 minute time limit has caught up with this match here at the Sam Houston Coliseum. But I tell you, time has not caught up with these guys yet because they are insisting on the right to pound each other just a little bit more. A determined referee trying to keep them separated, but you've got two big men who the referee has called this match a draw, but they, they are reluctant to discontinue and they are and again they they still want to come in there and the um, ox baker would like to get that mask off him the fans are telling him to and he hears them and as he goes in after the mask he almost got it got it off and then the spoiler decided to go up the aisle we'll be back here in a moment let's have this word from the studio.